been 17 reported murders so far in this latest outbreak of monster killings. It would appear to be the work of a single, highly psychotic perpetrator. The name of the latest victim was just released. A Professor Werner von Koy. A female, described as Caucasian, brunette and wearing a ponytail, was seen leaving the most recent crime scene. Officers are advised to use extreme caution when apprehending the suspect. At present, nothing appears to link any of the individuals involved. There are no known survivors of these attacks so far. something for me. Go on. I'm tracking five obscura paintings for a client called Eckhart, but he's a psychopath. Why should I care? Because I'm being stalked. People are dying out there. Handle it, Werner. Lara, please. Look, go and see this woman, Carvier. She can help. I'm going. Egypt, oh. Werner. You walked away and left me. Get out! Looks like a safe area, but I need to find a way out. To move around, use the left analog stick. Push forward gently to walk, and all the way forward to run. The bin looks climbable. To climb the bin, stand next to it and push forward on the left analog stick. 
To grab the balcony, walk to the edge of the bin and press the jump button. Then push forward on the left analog stick to climb up. This gap looks easy. To jump it, walk to the edge and stop. Remember, holding the walk button will stop me from falling off. Now press the jump button and push forward on the left analog stick at the same time. To climb the ladder, stand facing it and press forward on the left analog stick. To get off, push left on the left analog stick. Maybe I can climb through that window, walk up to the window and push forwards. I'll have a look around whilst I'm here. To open drawers and cupboards, stand in front of them and press action. It looks like I need something to force this open. The jump to that canopy looks challenging, but I think I can make it. Walk to the edge and stop. Now push forward and jump together. Then press action in mid-air to grab the canopy. Walk up to the railings, stop and push forward and I'll vault over easily. I can hop to the other side, hold down walk and press jump. Remember that by holding the walk button, I won't fall off any ledges. To climb off the drainpipe at the top, push up and diagonal in the direction you want to go. Don't keep me hanging around. I need to reach the roof before I lose my grip.
Now I've got my strength back, I can shimmy around that corner. Made it. No time to waste. I need to get to Carvier's apartment. Could be something useful in there. I need a way to prise those doors open. To move the barrel, stand next to it, then press and hold action. While still holding action, push forward to push the barrel or pull back to pull it. There's a crowbar down there. That'll come in useful. To hang from the edge of the building, walk to the ledge and press action. To make me let go, press action again, or push forward to climb back up. I need to shimmy to that walkway, but I don't think I'm strong enough yet. feel stronger now. the drain pipe, walk up to it and push forward.
I need to move quietly. Tap the stealth button, and then use the left analog stick to move me around. To hug the wall whilst moving in stealth, press the action button when I'm standing next to it. Push right or left to move me. When I reach a corner, I will peer around. the key. feel stronger.
This door is locked. I'll need a key. wire looks like it will take my weight. Press duck to tuck my legs up.
makes feel stronger. I'll make it across. Who is it? Mademoiselle Carvier. It's Lara Croft. I need your help. Miss Croft? I recognize you from photos and Werner's description. Come in. Thank you.
And even the night to be out alone, Miss Croft, our streets are not safe anymore. Mademoiselle Carvier, I have just come from Werner's apartment. And how is Werner? I'm afraid Werner is dead. Dead? Can I get you anything? How was Werner killed? What happened? It's all a bit vague. I arrived at his apartment today from London. He was babbling with fear. He said he tried to contact you. He did. I never expected that. Not after Egypt. Werner has been fearful for his life. He accepted a commission five weeks ago. Since then, he's been acting strangely, jumping at shadows. He even left a package with me for safekeeping. Package? His notebook. Addressed to you. Who was the commission from? The client's name was Erkhardt. He wanted Werner to research something called the Obscura Paintings. Then I approached me at my department at the Louvre. Were you able to help him? A little, I think. Poor Werner was clearly terrified. I wonder why exactly. He felt he was being stalked. He could well have been. The Monstrum is running around Paris, according to the press. You mentioned Werner's notebook earlier, Mademoiselle. His field notebook. He said he wanted you to have it if anything happened to him. If he left his notebook, he was spooked. You still haven't explained what happened. We argued. I can remember that. And gunfire. Gunfire? Then we were shot? Did you kill him? I can't remember. It's all a blur. Miss Croft. I strongly suggest that you talk to the police. Mademoiselle, I was a good friend of Werner's. I didn't kill him. I didn't! If you say so. Do you have the notebook? I do. It's safe for the moment. I really am going to need Werner's notebook. Somebody killed Werner. You say you don't remember clearly what happened. Perhaps the police are right in suspecting you. I never killed Werner! I think you'd better leave, Miss Croft. The notebook? I'm not sure this is the right thing, but I must respect what Werner wanted. The right choice, Mademoiselle. And now you had better go. The police will be here in a minute.
Is this your pitch? All Paris is my pitch. Got any spare change? For a coffee? Maybe. I need to find a man. Then look no further, my petite. This is a particular man. Bouchard. Louis Bouchard. Know him? <clears throat> no. Never heard of him. Even for spare change? Go away, I never heard of him. So where could I ask? I could use a coffee. How about you? Try the Café Metro. In the Place d'Arcade. The owner might be able to help you. Knows all kinds of stuff. Sounds like my kind of café. What about a spare change, mademoiselle? I didn't say I had any. Welcome to Paris. can climb. You looking for anything special, little lady? So what are you, a city guide? That's right, I'm a city guide, all tastes and interests catered for. Good, I need directions. I'm trying to find a man called Bouchard. Do you know him? That's not a healthy kind of question to be asking. Don't tell me Paris is dangerous. Oh, we got all kinds of rough stuff here in Paris, including our own serial killer. Have you heard of the Monstrum, huh? Have you heard of him? What do you really know about the Monstrum? Not much. Uh, the killings are very messy, uh, you know, uh, grisly, uh, no one's safe. Even Bouchard? Lady, no one, no exceptions. Have you heard uh, what the Monstrum does to the victims? So how do I contact Bouchard? He won't have time for casual callers. Been having staff problems at his club, I hear. Bouchard runs a club? Yeah, Le Serpent Rouge, flashy joint. Why should losing staff be such a big deal? Because these staff are dying on the job, messily, no one knows why or how. You don't think Bouchard's up to handling it? Keep your voice down. Bouchard can handle all he needs to, but this is something different, something creepy. His people didn't die pretty. It's got him really shaken. Is it the Monstrum? Who knows for sure? I just tried to keep my nose clean, you should too. So you've no idea where Bouchard is? No. Well, I'm sure someone does. I'll ask around. Yeah, do that. 
Why don't you try uh, Café Metro? What's a Café Metro? Nothing, man. Only the biggest loser in Paris. It's a joke. Forget it. Let me show you some of our local specialties. No thanks. Having to keep low, eh? <laughs> That's hard. Especially with the cops being so trigger happy. Should I give Bouchard your regards when I find him? No, don't do that. But if you are at a loose end, look me up. I'm sure we could find something diverting for you. You know, uh, something special. See you around. Not a lot of passing trade at this hour. It's early yet. Move along, ma chère. You make the place look crowded. Have you worked in this neighborhood for long? What can I do for you, chérie? I'm looking for someone you might know. Name of Bouchard. You won't find him here, ma chère. He did run the club across the road. Le Serpent Rouge, but had to move premises. There was a lot of trouble, I heard. Things needed to lie quiet for a while. And no one knows where he is. What do you need with a dangerous individual like Bouchard? I'm trying to track down a friend's movements. Lost, is he? Dead. But he made contact with Bouchard before he checked out. Tell you what, there's two guys who used to work at Le Serpent Rouge. So Bouchard didn't lose everybody? No. These two left before the troubles closed the place down. One's a miserable old devil called Bernard who was the janitor there. He hangs about in the park sometimes. And the other one? The other one, Pierre, worked as a barman. Makes bad deals that backfire on him. He runs the café at the Place d'Arcade now. Café Metro. You never know, might be worth a shot. Better than anything I have so far. Thanks. I didn't catch your name. Janice. Everyone knows me around here. Look, be careful, chérie. Bouchard's a mean operator, and he's been targeted hard recently. Does anyone know who's causing Bouchard all this grief, or why? No, or they're not saying. The Monstrum has got everyone too scared to talk. I'd have thought Bouchard would be geared up for trouble. He can handle it all right. No one better. But the way his people has been dying, mm, so ugly. And that poor woman. What woman? Someone called Carvier. She worked at the Louvre, it said on the radio. I don't want to talk about it. Carvier? No, you watch out, my chère. There is a lot of sickos loose on the streets. Yeah. That's okay. Some of us like it that way.
Hey, lady, keep away from the ring. Nice watch. What? Am I talking too fast for you? Okay, sister, you're leaving now. What about a wager? Yeah? On what? Those boys in the ring. What are their names? Look, lady. Come on, what are their names? Okay, guy with the tattoo is Zack. The one with the headgear is Carl. That's more like it. I bet all the cash in my pocket against your fancy gold watch that I can pick the best fighter. Do you have 200 jewels, smart mouth? Yes. Okay, you're on. Hey, you two. Lady here wants to bet on you decking each other. Match up. And just be glad I don't make you throw in your fancy gold chain, too. Don't push your luck, lady. So, who do you want to lose your money on? Zack looks like a good mover. My legs feel stronger.
Do you need uh, any help? I'm looking for someone. Name of Bouchard. Uh, this is just a herbalist. Uh, we stock medicinal potions and herbal extracts. So he isn't a customer of yours? A customer? Uh, no. Uh, would you like to purchase something? I'm told there's a story about a doorman in this area. Do you know it? The doorman is Bouchard's bodyguard. Find him and I find Bouchard? Yes, probably. What would I need? Money. A password. Who would know the right password? I'm afraid I can't help you there. Okay. Thanks anyway. Open for business. You managed to get in, didn't you? Just checking. I didn't want to waste your time, or mine. Discretion is my middle name. Especially with strangers who just walk in off the street. How concerned are you with legal niceties? What concerns me is the police. They ask a lot of questions. Do you? If it suits me, I make my own rules. Are you buying or selling? How much for these? Open for business. Depends what's in it for me. Are you buying or selling? Possibly both, but not right now. Come back when you have something to trade then. Qui vous a dit un truc pareil 
Ouais, c'est un peu car je voulais lui dire de ma part. Are you Pierre? Possibly. What can I get you? Information. Really? Well, everyone wants something for nothing. It needn't be for nothing. We could trade. Trade? You used to work at Le Serpent Rouge. I need to find your ex-boss, Bouchard. You don't look like police. No, I don't. But I do deal with problems. Sort them out. And they run errands, no doubt. If need be. And they pay well enough. Hm. <laughs> what sort of problems? What sort of problems do you have? Any situations need clearing up? Difficulties removed? In exchange for information about Louis Bouchard. Hmm. That's dangerous information. I'm a dangerous girl. And right now, I'm losing patience. I do have a situation that needs tidying. A retrieval job. Something I forgot to pick up from Le Serpent Rouge when I left in a hurry. It's mine, and I want it back. Why don't you just pick it up yourself? Two guesses. Bouchard? The Monstrum? Don't joke about the Monstrum. Bouchard ran a lot of operations there. The place will be staked out. Just tell me where the item is in the club. It's small. Small enough to fit inside one of the stage lights. The one that doesn't work. That's it? Okay. I can work with that. How do I get into the club? With this. This will get you in behind the stage area at the back. Return what's mine to me here, and I'll put you in touch with Louis Bouchard. I'm sure he'll be glad to hear from you again. He isn't going to. I just tell you where to find him. Then it's up to you. Okay. And if this doesn't work out, I know where to find you. Don't I, Pierre? Ouais, je suis le patron du RAD, et non, ça m'intéresse pas. Vous avisez plus de rappeler. Leave me alone, I'm busy!
Zanikl do střeženého prostoru.
Pronikl do stejného prázdna.
are not strong enough.
Non, cherche pas d'employé à mi-temps. Qui vous a dit un truc pareil Ben c'est un tocard. Vous pouvez lui dire de ma part. Did you... everything go okay? It's quiet in here. Your voice really carries. Don't mess me about. You were right about the place being staked out. There were gunmen all over the place. No sign of the Monstrum, though. You got it. Ah! Now... A little matter of Bouchard's whereabouts. Bouchard... yes, I'm... Um... You aren't going to disappoint me, are you? You don't want to see my dangerous side? No. It's just that someone else was asking for him. Just after you left. Asking for Bouchard? Yes. The customer who was sat in the corner, reading his paper. I couldn't tell him anything, naturally. But he may have overheard us. You know, you talk real loud. It's hard not to notice it. Okay, okay. Take it easy. Are we going to deal? Only if you behave. All right. Bouchard is lying low. I know someone who can show you where. You can trust them? This person you know? Just about. Name of Francine. She's my ex. Reassuring. This is her address. And the code for the gate. And she can point me to Bouchard? You sure? Oh, absolutely. She knows a discreet route to the back of the premises. Discreet? Translation. Dangerous. Nothing in Paris is safe. But this route will get you where you want to go. Please. It's arranged. She's expecting you. I hope this arrangement works out, Pierre. I'd hate for you to become a personal problem that I have to come back and tidy up. I don't think this friendship is working out, is it, Pierre? Only paying customers welcome. There's the door. Hello? Bouchard is in the old church. You need to find a mausoleum in the churchyard. It leads down into the church basement. Is this the best way? It's the only way past the doorman. Watch out for the ledges. They are dangerous. Where isn't these days? Welcome to Paris.
feel stronger now. I can climb this.
I can climb this. What happened to your man in the room out there, Bouchard? To Arno? You've got something to say about that? Maybe. It might be linked to what happened to a friend of mine. I doubt it. Get her out of here. Do you know the name Eckhart? Never heard of him. Okay. You helped a friend of mine a while back. Then a von Croy. Names don't mean a lot here. Even real ones. What did he want? Maps and information on the Louvre. I remember. Four weeks ago. Wanted to take a coachload of Japanese tourists to see the Mona Lisa. Easy, Bouchard. I lost that friend yesterday. Now I'm wanted for his murder. There was a newscast about a monstrum killing earlier. What would you know about that? Nothing that would interest you. You'd be surprised how much the monstrum interests me. My friend? The Louvre? Yes, the Academy. Wanted access to recent archaeological diggings inside the Louvre. I gave him contact. You want the same? And more. I need 9mm protection, backpack, plastic explosive, stun packs. Paris isn't safe these days. Who for? You obviously can't take care of yourself. Do you have what I need? I know who does. Daniel Rennes works out of the pawnbrokers on the corner of the Rue Saint-Marc and Cour-la-Seine.
What would you suggest? A trade. I have to get certain things into his hands. Passports. You could deliver them for me. Passports? Check passports. Nothing too dirty your hand with. It's a business arrangement. For which he would give me what I need. For the right price. The passports will prove you come through me. What happened to your man in the sick room back there? Was he delivering packages for you too? Poor Arno. One of my toughest. The only survivor of four attacks so far. Attacks? By who? An interesting question. We don't know for sure yet. The Paris Monstrum, perhaps? We're looking into that. You should take care. An automatic would help. You sold my friend Von Croy some hardware. I need the same. That was Ren. We need all the firepower we can get. Ren is your man. Is it a deal? Okay, deal. Who would know the right password? I'm afraid I can't help you there.
It's early yet. Move along, ma chère. You make the place look crowded. Werner obviously never had chance to collect it. Esteemed Cabal members, the hour of your reward grows ever closer. As you know, we already possess three of the Obscura paintings. Our contact profile. 
Professor von Croy located the fourth one for us here in Paris. Well, we have this. We all reassemble in Prague. It is time to awaken the sleeper. Hopefully, we will be more successful this time. We are also closer to the fifth and last obscure painting in Prague. We will gather at the straw of Gunnison. Master Eckhart. Dispatch your team for the fourth painting. Immediately. My arms aren't strong enough. That drain pipe will take my weight. I think I'm strong enough to turn those valves.
I can climb up on that. can make that jump. I'm up on that. Smell oil. I'd better be careful. I think.
think this is the place. Better check the map. Dive, girl. Dive. It's clean in here. Hey, vous, plus un geste. Strong enough. Hey, vous, plus un geste.
Et vous, plus un geste feel stronger. Uh. geste
feel stronger. geste Well, Mademoiselle keeps a tidy office.
Brother Obscura. Here's information on the artist who painted over the original images, Brother Obscura. It says he was ordered to disguise the black alchemist's paintings with religious imagery. Then the paintings were hidden. He made secret copies of the paintings, sketches, and hid them too. They became known as the Obscura engravings. Obscura paintings. There's information here on the Obscura paintings. It says there were five images painted on thick wooden bases, like Russian icons, I guess. They were created by the black alchemist Peter van Eckhart in the 13 or 1400s. Together, the five paintings hide something called the Sanglyph, or the blood sign. I wonder what that does. The paintings were seized by the Lux Veritatis from Eckhart and painted over with religious imagery. I wonder who the Lux Veritatis were. It says each painting has a metallic symbol of power built into it. So that's why Eckhart wants the paintings. This is the security pass I need.
Rendez-vous, plus un geste Et vous, plus un geste Let's see what we've got here. The Nephilim race. 
It says here that the Nephilim were the hybrid offspring of angels and humans. They were thought to be able to change their physical appearance and flourished in Turkey in early biblical times, now extinct. Well, you can't win them all.
My strength is increasing.
feel stronger now. Ultra Vigilis Umbram, Ece Veritas, through the spirit of the Keeper, behold the truth.
On ne bouge plus Swing to sector A9. Fan out and keep low. Okay, maintain radio silence. You have your targets. Move out. On ne bouge plus Respirators, and not before time. My foot speed has increased. Hold down the sprint button to run faster. Ah! 
protivník spozorová.
You okay? Bouchard, what are you doing here? No time now. Quickly! Was anyone around when you got here? No, no one. Come on! Bouchard, I must get back to Von Croy's apartment. There's something I have to check out there. Your friend's place, of course. Where is it? Rue Valise. The Chantel building. Do you know it? My driver will. Get in. What were you doing at the Louvre? Jory put it short wave. You were attracting a lot of attention in there. I figured you might need some help. Thanks. Wouldn't you prefer somewhere safer than your friend's apartment? I found some leads in the Louvre that may link to his death. I have to check his apartment. We're almost there. There's something you should know. The police bears were full of details of another monstrum killing in Prague. Prague? Not a dealer named Vasily. Matthias Vasily? Yes. You knew him? He's connected with what I need to find at Von Croy's apartment. I need to go in alone. Okay. I'll wait here. Appreciate it, Bouchard. inside now. You can send in the cleaner. Tracking five obscura paintings for a client. People are dying out there. Handle it, Vern. Egypt, Verna. You walked away and left me. Get out! Get out of the way!
the Lux Veritatis. Aha! Facts about the Lux Veritatis. They were a 12th century offshoot of the Knights Templar, dedicated to suppressing evil, particularly works of sorcery and alchemy, responsible for destroying Eckhart, the black alchemist in 1445, or so it says here. The Sanglyph. There's information here on the Sanglyph. It says the black alchemist Peter van Eckhart created an artifact of alchemic power, the Sanglyph. It was made in five metallic parts and hidden. Perhaps those were the metal symbols in the obscure paintings. My legs feel stronger. The Cabal. Let's see what we have on the Cabal. A powerful alliance of five alchemists and sorcerers in the 13 and 1400s. Eckhart is said to have betrayed and murdered almost all of them to control their secrets. Now that is interesting. It says the Cabal and the Lux Veritatis battled constantly, even after the disappearance of the black alchemist Eckhart in 1445.
aware of yet? Hello. Is she dead yet? We have to get back to Prague. No, Bouchard. She isn't. But your little friend is. I'll take care of you later. It's time I visited Prague. Another cold, dark city. Great. Don't you just love this weather? What do you know about that building over there? Uh, what? The one you're watching, with police tape all around it. The Vasily place? It's a murder scene. I'm a reporter. So what happened in there? Another monstrum killing. You're not from around here. No, I need information, which I'd be willing to pay for. It'll cost you. I gather Vasily was some kind of art dealer. More than that, he was involved with the Mafia. Mafia? What makes you think so? Lady, I know so. I've been investigating Vasily's activities for some time. Tell me why he was murdered then. Vasily found something they wanted and got smudged because he tried to hang on to it. They set the monstrum on him. You say he found something. Do you know what it was? A painting, perhaps? I don't know about that, but he was definitely silenced. The Mafia tidied away all the evidence took it to the Strahov. Now you're going to tell me what the Strahov is, aren't you? No, your credit just ran out. Keep talking till the money runs out. It's not that. This is dangerous stuff, I'm telling you. I shouldn't be shooting off my mouth. You're a big boy. You can handle it. Tell me your name. Ludic. My name's Ludic. Okay, Ludic. What else? Yeah. The Strahov is the Mafia center of operations in Prague. There's been a lot of activity there recently. You're well informed. I'm a professional. It's my business. I've got dossiers on all the main players. It'll cost you. Okay, I'm in. You call these dossiers? Yuck! Do you know who that is? No, he arrived yesterday. That's Bouchard. He's a Parisian gang boss. I ran into him over a personal matter. Really? Is he Paris Mafia then? No idea. Who's that? That's Eckhart. He's the Mafia top guy from what I can find out, but I know less about him than the others. They're all gathered in the Strahov at the moment. All of them? All six major players. Eckhart and the other five. Ludwig, I have to get in there. Today. How would you manage it? It's not easy. The place is heavily guarded. Security gates, cameras, ident scanners. But... But I could get an access code. I have contacts. It'll take me half an hour. Okay. While you're on your errand, I'm going to start with Vasily's. Be careful in there. And don't keep me waiting. It's not healthy to hang about on the streets. Especially in weather like this. Stay warm.
It's seven. I want some answers, Bouchard. Why did you want me dead in Paris? You were just a side issue. A loose end that needed tidying up. Who ordered it? A madman called Eckhart. He was putting pressure on all my operations. Threatened my family. Killing my men. You saw one of them at the church. A psycho, huh? The worst. Eckhart! Is the monstrum. Is that right? What exactly were you doing for him? I had to take delivery of a painting that was in the Louvre and bring it to the Strauf here in Prague. My painting? That wasn't easy to get out of the Louvre, Bouchard. Seemed everyone's a loser. So why Prague? Eckhart is protected by a group based in Prague called the Cabal. They're almost as dangerous as Eckhart and at least as insane. I was told the Mafia ran Prague. The Cabal used the Mafia front to distract attention from their real activities. But they're far more dangerous and powerful. Dangerous enough to use the Mafia as a front? Anyone too inquisitive about Cabal business simply disappears. Like my friend Von Croy. What was his involvement in all this? He was hired to look at one of the five obscure paintings that was in the Louvre. But he found out too much. He contacted Vasily, here, in Prague, and they exchanged information. I found Vasily's faxes. 
and four obscure engravings he sent to Von Croy. Vasily originally had five engravings, but kept one back. Why are the engravings important? Each engraving contains an encoded map of a particular painting's location. So one of those engravings told Von Croy where the Louvre painting was? Yes, but your friend got careless. The faxes were intercepted by the Cabal, and then Eckhart didn't need Von Croy. It was another Luzern to be tied up, like Vasily. Killed like Vasily, you mean? Why does Eckhart do that to the bodies, Bouchard? And what does he want the paintings for? I don't know the details, but it's something to do with reviving the Cubiculum Nephili. The Cubiculum Nephili? The Sleeper. Last of the extinct Nephilim race. You've heard of the Sleeper. Eckhart is insane. He thinks he can use the Sleeper to breed the extinct Nephilim back into existence. There's no faulting his ambition, is there? So this fifth engraving that Vasily kept back is the key to the last Obscura painting. I'm going to take a look around. It'll be well hidden. Vasily was very cautious. Not cautious enough. The map in the last engraving shows the location called the Vault of Trophies. The vault was one of the last Lux Veritatis secret strongholds, and Eckhart's been desperate to get into it. A Lux Veritatis vault? They seized all five obscure paintings in the late 1400s and hid them. The last one is almost definitely in the vault. So do you know where the vault is located? Only that it's beneath the Strahov somewhere. And the painting is definitely there? Eckhart thinks so. It's one of the reasons the Cabal built the stronghold there. I'm going to take a look around. Are you going to leave me like this? Yes. Take a break. You've been running round a lot. I'll be back with the fifth engraving. My strength is increasing. Thank you. 
the periapt shards. Here's something about the periapt shards. They were said to be three weapons of light. Three crystalline shards shaped like spearheads. Hmm. No one knows how they worked. Tres periapti conjuncti cum justicie igne mala kingunt. The sleeper, cubiculum nephili. It says here, the sleeper, or cubiculum nephili, a stone cask, reputed to contain the last remains of the extinct Nephilim race, buried somewhere in Turkey. Here. Let's see if he's got keys to this place. Did you get me the Strahov code? I told you, I am a professional, but I want the exclusive story. Events in Paris and whatever happens here. Done. This passcode will get you into the warehouse area. It's only a low-level pass, but at least you'll be inside the complex. I can take it from there. Have you tried this code yourself? Me? No, the place gives me the creeps. Workers have gone missing and all kinds of spooky stuff. What goes on in there? God knows. I'd give my innards to find out. But it's way too gothic for me. If you uncover anything, give me first shot at it, huh? Sure thing. I also got this. It could come in handy. The Strahov is one weird place. A handy machine pistol. Gas punch reloader. No invasion force should be without one. How much? Have you seen what these can do? How much? 800 euros. Okay, let's talk in the car. The Strahov isn't far.
Pozorová.
my strength is increasing. if I don't report in. Found him skulking around in the loading bay. Must have got a Pasco. How's the door on your way up, Gleason? I have records on you, Eckhart. You can't hurt me. If only there was time for us to read them together. But it's too late now. There are things to be done. <laughs>
小心走 I wonder what needs that kind of security to keep it in. Wouldn't you know it? My route goes through that biodome. It's a long way round, unless I can shut the power off to that section. That's it. Better get moving whilst the grid's down. Někdo tu je!
Don't breathe, and definitely don't move. You are in big trouble, whoever you are. Intruders don't last long in Strahov. Just answer my questions. Fine. First question, who are you? Second question, what are you and your buddies up to in here? You really don't know what the Cabal is. We are the beginning of a new order of life on Earth. Well, I've never heard of you. Ignorant mortal. The Cabal! We control everything here in Prague. It means that we are going to be immortal. And you are going to be dead, intruder. Immortal? That is impressive. How are you going to manage that? Meister Eckhart is about to return the Nephilim race to glory. For our part in that triumph, he will grant us immortality. If I had a coconut for every time some lunatic said something like that. Your pathetic ignorance blinds you. We already have the last vital element from Turkey here in Strahov. And that is? The only true remaining Nephilim. The Cubiculum Nephili, the Sleeper. That's right. The last of the extinct race here in the Strahov. Surely the Nephilim are just a myth. You see, ignorance. With vital essences extracted from this precious specimen, Meister Eckhart can breed the next generation of pure Nephilim. No more abomination to run amok like Boaz's proto-Nephilim. She deserved to pay for her stupidity. Yes. Highly inconvenient having abominations running around loose, isn't it? You have no idea what you are mocking.
This ledge looks too far. I don't think I'll make it yet. My strength has increased. Maybe now I can make it across that ledge. There's chaos out there. Why has the power been cut off? Is this you doing Miller? No. The power's down everywhere. Just control things in the dome then. Do it. It's everything locked down. We don't want anything getting loose. It's under control, Master Eckhart. We have a problem down in the sanatorium. What problem, Boaz? Just have the guards deal with your inmates and pets. I have a confession, Master Eckhart. I didn't destroy the Proto-Nephilim. The Proto? You are kidding. Right, Boaz? I need to supervise this personally. That experiment was to be eradicated. I expressly ordered it. It's far too dangerous to keep alive. I couldn't! It's half Nephilim! That makes it impossible to kill without your belly up shard! You ignored my orders for the last time, Boaz. Mullah, I need the services of one of your little creations. Ah, please, no! It wasn't my fault! I'm loyal! Your own incompetence has sentenced you, Boaz. Give me a chance! What the fuck? I will be obeyed. Now sort this mess out.
It's jammed. have made a mess of things, haven't you? Who for? The stalker who stole my painting. What do you need with the painting? Maybe I'll explain later, Ms. Croft. But for now, I need to go and turn the power back on. Leaving me here? You've caused enough problems over the last two days. Safer for everyone if you stay in one place for a while. You'll be okay in there. And this? My periap shard. You... Picked it up in the Louvre, yes. After you stole my painting. All this can wait. I know where you'll be. Take a breather from damaging things, why don't you?
this would be one of my easy days. The ability will help here.
Thanks. Glad you came back to save me, stranger. Name's Curtis. Lara. And this is business. I owe you one. You owe me a painting. Sorry. That went AWOL at the Louvre. What brings you here from Paris? Eckhart. We have business that only one of us will walk away from. You? Personal reasons. Eckhart plans to use all five obscure paintings to revive an ancient evil called the Sleeper and rebreed the Nephilim race. To do that, he collects alchemically transmuted elements from his murder victims' bodies. I've seen him at work as the Monstrum. With that glove. Eckhart's the original black alchemist. And now he's very close to finding the last painting. Does he know where it is? Yes. It's hidden in the Lux Veritatis vault beneath the straw hole. The paintings must be destroyed. To do that, I need the shard you picked up the loom. There should be three Periot shards. Eckhart has the last one. If all three shards are united, they can destroy him permanently. So he keeps it safe. Tell me about the shards. They're ancient weapons of the Lux Veritatis. Two of them are entrusted to my father. Eckhart murdered him to stop them passing in my hands. He failed. So Eckhart went after your father, and you want revenge. Justice. We should work together. You're trusting me? Here. How can they be used to kill Eckhart? He must be stabbed with all three shards. We can divide the forces against us if we split up. You need the third shard, so you should go after that. I'll find the last painting and destroy it. Okay. Eckhart guards the shard in his old alchemy lab in the lower regions. I can find my way there. The engraving shows the painting hidden in something called the Vault of Trophies. Here. The entrance is underwater. No problem. How did she get the engraving and the map? It doesn't matter. We have lost too many men trying to open that damn vault. Perhaps her special talents will help us get what we need. The mail will be coming this way soon. Make the preparations. There's no danger she can destroy the last painting. We won't allow her the opportunity. The fifth Obscura painting is mine already. And then...
feel stronger now.
The brothers reunited see the gates thrown open. My strength is increasing.
Congratulations, Miss Croft. You are positively Amazonian. That vault has defeated us for months. What do you want, Eckhart? I'm not interested in you or your friend, Miss Croft. Give me the painting. May both be. What choice do I have? Gunderson, release Boaz. This old colleague of mine was once a human before she displeased me. Not you, Muller, you useless piece of dross. You failed me too! Speciality, Curtis. Don't worry about ugly here. Go on. You're wasting time. I can take care of her.
My legs feel stronger. Maybe I'll make that jump.
still alive, Miss Croft. You are resilient, but over the decades I've killed more mortals like you than I can remember. And stole their body parts, like a cheap grave robber. As I will now take yours. To wake this thing, you are grotesque. Only my great hearts can cause the higher race to flourish again. So I guess it's up to me to stop you then. I hunted down and killed the last of the Lux Veritatis. I am immortal. The Shards! Scary, huh? For you. It is my destiny to breathe hell on Earth. You are nothing to me. Do you know, it's going to be a real pleasure to shut you up.
Karel? Go on, kill her. I knew you'd find the third shard. But why? You worked for him. No, unknowingly, he worked for me. But his usefulness was ended. Will you destroy his work? Of course not. The great work will be finished. I'm offering you the chance to become part of a benign new order in the world. You are kidding, right? We Nephilim have only ever been trying to survive. Too many people have died for me to trust you, including a good friend. Von Croy. He was an unfortunate victim of history, Lara. Eckhart was stupid to have killed him. I've helped you all along, both here and in Paris. You can trust me, Lara Croft. I'm tracking five obscura paintings for a client called Eckhart, but he's a psychopath. Why should I care? Because I'm being stalked. People are dying out there. Handle it, Werner. Lara, please. Look, go and see this woman, Kavi. She can help. I'm going. Egypt, Verna. You walked away and left me. There was no pity then. Get out! Get out of the way! But she'll be able to. No! Your usefulness is finished. You killed Von Croy. Stupid mortal. So be it. Ugh! <sighs> 